Hey, so I'm making this because I I think I figured out yoga after, I don't even know, years and years and years of kind of thinking it was, well, anyway. So um, I, I've been working hard consistently every single day. Um, it really started at the beginning of May of 2023 um, to get over anxiety because I just am tired of feeling bad. Um, I want to have a better life. I want to be a better um, partner. I want to be a better friend. I want to be a better everything. And being fearful all the time isn't helping that. So one thing I implemented is um, breathing exercises. And, and all I do is, like, if I'm feeling stressed, I just close my eyes and lean back, you know, a little bit and just take a couple breaths. And all that really does is it it shifts focus away from whatever is stressing me out if only for a minute and um, you know sometimes I'll take one breath sometimes I'll take a few and you know it, it really depends on the situation but <clears throat> that's something I've been doing several times a day and, and it's helping and then yoga um, yoga is kind of like a, a, a uh, I, I don't even I'm, I'm not sure I would do yoga like as a, as a workout but more as, uh, so, so for example, I, I was stressed out a minute ago, so I stood up and I did the, you know, arms overhead pose, and then I did the forward fold, and I did breathing, and it's kind of like a more intense version of the breathing exercises. And I guess the best way that I can think of putting it is it is a, it's a distraction. Um, or if you don't want to, I mean, that's kind of negative language, call it like a management technique. Um, so now like I'll, I'll stand up and I'll touch my toes or I'll stretch against the wall or I'll just it, it just is kind of like it's like a reset you know shake it off it's a little bit of a reset um, I'm I'm doing okay um, you know I've been anxious for 45 years so I can't uh, this stuff isn't gonna go away overnight but um, you know these these concepts like breathing exercises stretching yoga and all that are and mindfulness are all beginning to make a little more sense to me now um, it's it's you don't at least I don't do them in and of themselves I do them as management techniques anxiety management um, you know there's, there's no sense sitting there like oh god what am I gonna do you know just a couple breaths All right, calm down, calm down, okay. You know, the thing that you're working on or whatever is still gonna be there after you're done breathing. But this, to me, th this is helping a lot. So um, I'll post more as I figure more out. And you know, I know that last video I posted was pretty crappy, the audio was pretty crappy. I'm gonna redo it at some point and, and actually explain it. But uh, I encourage you just, you know, just, do, do like a toe touch with some, or, you know, and don't force it. It's supposed to feel mildly uncomfortable, you know, in, in your hamstrings and your butt. And just breathe, breathe a few times. And I think you'll find that you feel a little bit better, you know, and maybe if I do that a hundred times a day, I'll feel better a hundred times a day. And then eventually it'll become a habit and I'll feel better. I mean, honestly, that's the goal is to tip the scales and make me feel better more than I feel bad. Um, I, I hope one day that anxiety is a thing of the past, but I don't know. But uh, I'm certainly going to keep trying because it is, it's worth it. See ya.